Now, the latest development from Google that it describes as a state-of-the-art quantum computer chip. The company claims Willow Leapfrog. Google's quantum computing division has just made a groundbreaking announcement that has sent shockwaves through the tech world. Their latest quantum chip has demonstrated performance capabilities that could potentially render NVIDIA's dominance in computing obsolete. This revelation is not just a technological milestone, but a paradigm shift in the competitive landscape of advanced computing. It challenges the status quo of GPU-based computing that has been central to NVIDIA's success and introduces quantum computing as a viable contender for the most demanding computational tasks. To understand the significance of this development, we need to dive into the basics of quantum computing and how it differs from classical computing, including NVIDIA's powerful GPUs. Quantum computers operate on quantum bits, or qubits, which leverage the principles of quantum mechanics such as superposition and entanglement. Unlike classical bits, which exist as either zero or one, qubits can exist in multiple states simultaneously. This allows quantum computers to process and analyze data at speeds exponentially faster than even the most advanced classical supercomputers. NVIDIA, on the other hand, has been a leader in high-performance computing, with GPUs driving advancements in artificial intelligence, machine learning, and data analytics. Their architecture has powered everything from scientific research to gaming and self-driving cars. GPUs are incredibly efficient at parallel processing, enabling them to handle massive amounts of data and complex computations. Until now, NVIDIA has been at the forefront of computational innovation, with no real competitors threatening their dominance in these fields. Google's quantum chip, however, changes the game entirely. In a series of tests conducted by Google's research team, their quantum processor demonstrated a level of computational power that could solve problems previously thought to be beyond the reach of classical computing. This leap in performance is not just incremental, but transformative. For tasks such as optimization, cryptography, and material simulation, quantum computing could outperform classical GPUs by orders of magnitude. One of the most striking demonstrations of Google's quantum chip was its ability to perform quantum simulations that would take the world's most advanced classical supercomputers thousands if not millions of years to complete. These simulations are critical for understanding complex systems in physics, chemistry, and biology. For example, quantum simulations can help researchers design new materials at the molecular level, enabling breakthroughs in energy storage, pharmaceuticals, and more. NVIDIA's GPUs, while incredibly powerful, are fundamentally limited by the constraints of classical physics. Quantum chips, on the other hand, operate in an entirely different paradigm, unlocking possibilities that were previously unimaginable. This raises a critical question. Is this the beginning of the end for NVIDIA's dominance in computing? The answer is complex and multifaceted. NVIDIA's GPUs are not going away anytime soon. They remain indispensable for a wide range of applications, from training AI models to powering graphics-intensive tasks. However, the rise of quantum computing represents a tectonic shift in the industry, one that could redefine what we consider cutting-edge technology. Google's quantum chip is not just about raw power, it's also about efficiency. One of the major challenges in high-performance computing is energy consumption. Data centers around the world consume massive amounts of electricity, much of it dedicated to running and cooling GPUs. Quantum computers, by contrast, have the potential to perform the same or greater levels of computation with significantly lower energy requirements. This could lead to a more sustainable future for computing, addressing one of the most pressing concerns of the modern tech industry. The implications of this breakthrough extend far beyond NVIDIA. Entire industries stand to be disrupted by quantum computing. For example, in finance, quantum algorithms could revolutionize portfolio optimization and risk assessment. In logistics, they could enable unprecedented levels of efficiency in supply chain management. In cybersecurity, quantum computing could both break current encryption methods and create unbreakable quantum encryption, fundamentally altering the landscape of digital security. It's important to note that Google is not the only player in the quantum computing race. Companies like IBM, Microsoft, and Regetti are also making significant strides in developing quantum technologies. 
However, Google's latest quantum chip appears to have set a new benchmark, putting them ahead in the race to achieve practical quantum supremacy. This term, coined by Google itself, refers to the point at which a quantum computer can perform a task that no classical computer can achieve in a reasonable time frame. Despite the hype, quantum computing is still in its infancy. There are significant challenges to overcome, including error correction, scalability, and the need for specialized environments to maintain qubit stability. Quantum computers operate at temperatures close to absolute zero, requiring sophisticated cooling systems that are far from practical for widespread deployment. NVIDIA's GPUs, by contrast, are robust, scalable, and compatible with existing infrastructure, giving them a distinct advantage in the near term. Another critical factor is software. Quantum computing requires entirely new algorithms and programming paradigms. While progress has been made in developing quantum software, it is still a nascent field. NVIDIA, on the other hand, has a well-established ecosystem of tools, libraries, and frameworks that make it easy for developers to harness the power of GPUs. This ecosystem has been a key factor in NVIDIA's success and will continue to be a competitive advantage as quantum computing matures. The competition between Google and NVIDIA also highlights a broader trend in the tech industry, the convergence of hardware and software innovation. NVIDIA's CUDA platform, for instance, has been instrumental in driving GPU adoption for machine learning. Similarly, Google's TensorFlow framework has become a cornerstone of AI development. As quantum computing evolves, the companies that can seamlessly integrate hardware and software will have a significant edge. What does this mean for the future of NVIDIA? While Google's quantum chip poses a potential threat, it also presents an opportunity. NVIDIA has already begun exploring quantum computing, investing in research and development to ensure they remain at the forefront of technological innovation. By leveraging their expertise in GPUs, NVIDIA could play a crucial role in bridging the gap between classical and quantum computing. Hybrid systems that combine the strengths of both paradigms could be the next frontier, enabling unprecedented levels of performance and efficiency. Despite the hype, quantum computing is still in its infancy. There are significant challenges to overcome, including error correction, scalability, and the need for specialized environments to maintain qubit stability. Quantum computers operate at temperatures close to absolute zero, requiring sophisticated cooling systems that are far from practical for widespread deployment. NVIDIA's GPUs, by contrast, are robust, scalable, and compatible with existing infrastructure, giving them a distinct advantage in the near term. Another critical factor is software. Quantum computing requires entirely new algorithms and programming paradigms. While progress has been made in developing quantum software, it is still a nascent field. NVIDIA, on the other hand, has a well-established ecosystem of tools, libraries, and frameworks that make it easy for developers to harness the power of GPUs. This ecosystem has been a key factor in NVIDIA's success and will continue to be a competitive advantage as quantum computing matures. The competition between Google and NVIDIA also highlights a broader trend in the tech industry, the convergence of hardware and software innovation. NVIDIA's CUDA platform, for instance, has been instrumental in driving GPU adoption for machine learning. Similarly, Google's TensorFlow framework has become a cornerstone of AI development. As quantum computing evolves, the companies that can seamlessly integrate hardware and software will have a significant edge. What does this mean for the future of NVIDIA? While Google's quantum chip poses a potential threat, it also presents an opportunity. NVIDIA has already begun exploring quantum computing, investing in research and development to ensure they remain at the forefront of technological innovation. By leveraging their expertise in GPUs, NVIDIA could play a crucial role in bridging the gap between classical and quantum computing. Hybrid systems that combine the strengths of both paradigms could be the next frontier, enabling unprecedented levels of performance and efficiency. Giving it a gravitational influence that shapes the fate of nearby objects, a striking example of this occurred in 1994 when the two-kilometer-wide comet Shoemaker-Levy 9 ventured too close to Jupiter. The planet's gravity not only captured the comet, but also tore it apart, breaking it into several fragments. By the time the fragments impacted Jupiter, they were already scattered, 
marking the first ever direct observation of an extraterrestrial collision.